All right, you caught me here. I have my uh, notes <laughs> because I can't remember all these uh, movies that have been nominated for Oscars, which are on uh, Sunday night here on ABC 21, and uh, the Cinema Center is celebrating. Mm -hmm. Joan is uh, from the Cinema Center. Uh, your Saturday night event is what? It is Cinema Center Scenes the Oscars. It's a bit of a tongue twister, as I say uh -huh. it out loud. Um, so, you know, there was a really big movie this year called La La Land. Right. It kind of brought a lot of attention to musicals. So this is kind of our tribute to the great Hollywood uh, musical. You know, we're going to have a lot of fun, of course, silent live auctions, but we are going to have a screening afterwards of Singing in the Rain, which is, you know, kind of works as a tribute to Debbie Reynolds, right. who unfortunately we lost recently, but also as a great tribute to, like, one of the pinnacle of movie musicals. So, you know, I was in my head when you said La La Land and musicals, I'm like, well, they haven't really done musicals since, you know, the 50s, but that's not true either, because like Les Mis was yeah, obviously yeah. successful. And in Chicago a few years before that. Right? So musicals have never really gone away, but it seems like for whatever reason, this film has really infatuated the movie going audience, and La La Land has really made people start thinking about musicals as a genre again. Mm -hmm. So does that mean that we're probably going to see more of them? I would imagine we're probably going to at least see a couple more, and they'll see how that goes and whether or not it's going to take off or not. Right. So, uh, all right. So, so talk to me then about this event specifically. Mm -hmm. I, I, the title is great. Is there karaoke? What, what, what's, so, what's happening? So there's going to be lots of musical-related fun, I guess, and throughout the evening. And also we're going to have performances from the Fort Wayne Dance Collective, and mm -hmm. they're going to do kind of their interpretations of, you know, famous mu um, musical numbers from these movies. That's fantastic. Yeah. So uh, so tickets, where, how, when? So tickets are $30 um, in advance, and they're still available at cinemacenter.org, or you can just go to the box office, and it's only $50 for couples. And it's this, because, uh, you know, you hear Oscar, you mm -hmm. think tuxedo, Formal wear is this a formal event? It's not a formal event. We like you if you if you want to express your love of movie musicals through the way you dress, go uh -huh. for it. So if you want to come in dressed to the nines, go for it. If not, you know if you want to come in like a jet or a shark from West Side Story, you can yep. do that as well. That's a good one. I was and, I know I was going through the list here. I'm like, oh wait, there's Grease. You know, it's yeah, like exactly. obviously Sound of Music. You mm -hmm. start populating your head here with musicals. There's a lot more than I thought. Yeah, I mean they were really the dominant genre from like you know the night from sound really from you know the third. 30s on mm -hmm. until they kind of went out about the 1960s, you know, and then they kind of popped here and there. But I, I, I always dive into conversations with you mm -hmm. under the assumption, unfortunately, that everybody knows what Cinema Center is. Okay. Which is probably not 100% true, much to your dismay, that yeah. you always find new people that are like, I didn't know you were here. Yeah, exactly. Um, we, you know, we've been around for 40 years, so it's kind of amazing that people don't know we're here. But yeah, it's, we're the home of uh, mostly art house uh, film in Fort Wayne, but we're really just a house of people who love movies mm -hmm. in general. We show a lot of independent foreign and documentary films. We show, we have shown so many Oscar-nominated films. We um, you know Moonlight, um, I Am Not Your Negroes, um, finishing up its run t uh, tonight. Um, but we, sh we show a whole bunch of different things. I mean, next month in March, we're going to have a special screening of Mad Max Fury Road, which is not a very Cinema Center type film, right. but we found a way to make it work for Women's History Month. So um, we just do a whole, we run a whole gambit of films that we show. And uh, the reason, I guess, behind this is just to celebrate kind of the art, yes. not necessarily the commercial side of movies. Exactly. You know, we're in a nonprofit arts organization, so we want to celebrate that. It is a true American art form. It's like accessible art form. It's a way in which we can create empathy um, between P an audience, what they see on the screen. We want them to take those stories home and, you know, in the best case scenario, it's some, it really makes an impact on their lives. Yeah. All right. We uh, do want to talk about uh, the Oscars, which of course mm -hmm. air here on ABC 21 on uh, Sunday night. We'll have Jonah maybe make a few predictions. You up for that? I'm up for it. Because anything I say is not uh, relevant at all, because <laughs> I think I haven't seen, well, any of them, quite frankly. Uh, but again, Cinema Center sings the Oscars is Saturday night, 6 to 9, with the uh, special showing afterwards. We'll be right back on Insight.